Ijs en marinade, kooldrank en ijs, goeie kos en vriende, groot wedstrijd rugby en lekker braai. Eg Suid-Afrikaanse combinaties soos jy en pick and pay. <laughs> so Jeannie D and I are getting our hands dirty by making snook. Snook, it's the first time really that I've made snook. Do you ever braai, Jeannie? I like to go to a braai. In terms of being an active participant, not really. <laughs> I'll pour the drinks. <laughs> well, I'm going to get you to assist us here in the kitchen. We are making a gorgeous snook. And if you'd like the ingredients sent to your mobile phone, you can do that right now. SMS the keyword snook, S-N-O-E-K, to 33728. I've sent you an outside to actually get the braai ready. You yes. and I are going to make a gorgeous apricot sauce. Now, I'm from Joburg. We don't make our, our snook this way with apricot. Are you making a proper sauce? Yes. I was just rubbing the no, apricot on the fish. <laughs> Some apricot jam, orange some juice. garlic, some orange juice. You can use apricot juice. Do you actually cook for yourself? I do, yes. That is yeah, very impressive. We, we have to when you're working on espresso, because yes. we learn to make it all every day and it takes about five exactly. to, to 30 minutes. And um, the one thing I'm terrible at, Jeannie, is I don't know how to start a braai. Unless it's a gas bra. Oh, I, I can know. make the fire. Oh, I can totally do that. that. So in like terms it. of cooking the actual food, that's the challenge. But making the fire, starting the bra, I can do that. I'm a boy in a woman's body. It's easy. Yeah. <laughs> you don't look like a boy in a woman's body. <laughs> there we go. So that's what you do. You just need to... You just need to make that sauce. It smells great. It's freezing outside. So we've sent Ewan outside with an umbrella, a raincoat, and he's busy getting the bra ready. How's it going out there, Ewan? Hey, it's cold, <laughs> it's cold, there's ominous clouds above me, it's been drizzling, but we are brying. Of course we are brying. The snook is looking fantastic, Liesl. Oh, I'm gonna bring it in for you guys just now. Hang on, almost done. <laughs> so you're like in that how is that weather? I was gonna join him, but my hair will mince out there with all that <laughs> rain and wind. Now I'm taking this apricot sauce that we've made, it's delicious, and I'm just basting it. Ewan's already got it outside as well. And what you can do as well is just keep doing that uh, over the braai while you're cooking it. In Joburg and Pretoria, we like to make it with lemon. Mm -hmm. Juice and I'm Portuguese. I love the garlic and uh, garlic. You'll never get parsley. sick if you throw a lot of garlic on. That's why I threw in extra garlic. So yeah. baste your snook. Let us know on our Facebook page, Expresso Morning Show SABC3. What type of fish you like to braai? What do you like to braai? And do you like you like to braai in the rain? And have you got any tips for us <laughs> braaiing in the rain? As you saw, you and had the umbrella. Do you have anything that you've mastered or, or made for yourself to protect you from the Cape winter rain? And uh, let us know on our Facebook page, Expresso Morning Show. SABC3. ABC3. Now what you can do as well, Jeannie, is you can actually take whole pieces of tomato okay. and put it in the inside of your snook once you've basted it. Do you and know how many people I know in Cape Town that have got indoor braai as well? That's I a think big thing that's for Cape the way Town. to go. Yeah, indoor braai. You have an indoor and an outdoor one, I think. It's perfect for <laughs> South African weather. Okay, this looks amazing. It if smells this tastes gorgeous. good, I'm going to be very impressed. Jeannie, is this okay. the first time you've tried to cook? We should get you here regularly. Well, every time I come here, I kind of learn something new. Mm -hmm. And that's the only cooking that gets done. <laughs> you wash the dishes. I've got a great dishwasher. Um, and I pack the dishwasher. Okay. There's a system to it that I'm quite proud to say that I know. So I'm not entirely useless. <laughs> You're doing a good job here. <laughs> These nails weren't made for dishwashing. Now, once you've done there, you can put a little bit of salt and pepper and some spices on. I think cooking is just about doing. I don't think there's any major skill attached to that. I know that all the chefs are going to go, Bleh! but I, I think if you if you put your mind to it and you do it, mm. I know what tastes nice because I love to eat. Yes. So surely if I throw those flavours together, we'll get a little bit of something. Well, we're going to see now. <laughs> okay. So That's once you've done much. this, and some pepper, we're going to wrap it in the tin foil. Okay. And we're going to put it on our brine. Great. So it's technically we've bried and made snook and everything today, Jeannie. You're going quite... No, no, I'm instructing you yours. because you've got it there. Okay. Our keyword today is snook, S-N-O-E-K, snook. Wrap snook. it up. Let okay, me. wait, do I actually... Oh, Just my hands are going to smell like fish all day now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. This is what happens when you put two women in the kitchen to make something. There we go! So fold the fish over. Yes. Well done. Look at this. Now we need to go put this it on the bra. This is going to be delicious. It is. Now you know what? We've done it already. You <laughs> one's already bright it. You can oh. put it back down, Jeannie. We don't even have to put it on the bry. Our bry mate. Hello, ladies. You and... Look at this. Hello, ladies. Oh, wow. wow. There we go. Look at that, wow, eh? Wow, this looks amazing. Jeez, you're such a typical girl, eh? Oh, it's gonna smell like fish. Eh? You can wash it afterwards. 
can wash it. With lemon. Yeah, yeah. You exactly. see? Exactly. This looks delicious. What's that? It? That's it. That's it. It's done. Oh, I could totally well do that. You see, I can work. Thanks, you. Well done. And you bride. And I bride. You see, a true South African man will bride in any weather. Mm -hmm. That is how it goes. This right, looks extreme amazing. Blind. Yes. This looks absolutely amazing. <laughs> Are you going to try it? Hey? And your hair didn't freeze. It didn't. It didn't freeze, eh? A little bit wet, but it's fine. Okay, as the bright champion on Espresso, you know, you are going to be the first to try. You know, okay. You can't tell Yanez that you're the bright champion. He thinks he's the bright master. Sorry, Yanez. Mm. <laughs> I'm the bright champ. That is good. That is really good. Sweet mm -hmm. apricot jam. Mm. I've never made snook like this, I have to admit. Mm. This but is the first for me. Well, We're now we give know. it a try. You, <laughs> and you are a ledge for braving this weather. True South African. Mm, thank you very much. I don't know what was braver, going into Bry in the rain or wearing this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, do you know? Well, you would have worn this as well with this nice outfit you can get wet, you know? <laughs> Just easy. Now, if you'd like to get the recipe, go to our website, expressoshow.com. Guys, why don't we enjoy the snook and the great entertainment that Expresso has lined up for us. Kat, over to you.